It was a quiet night. Six o'clock on a Monday, the 15th, 1932. Crime has been quiet for a while now. Are you Detective Maloney? Yes. Yes, I am. I knew from the second she walked in that door, she was trouble. Excuse me? Ah, uh, can, can I help you or something? I was walking in the park, and I bent over to fix my skirt, and... Oops. I was robbed. I suspected it was about some sort of diamond. It was stolen. What kind of diamond? It's a family treasure. Was there any evidence of this crime? Only this. Just what I thought. Don't worry, ma'am. I'll get your diamond back. Really, Detective Malone? Do you really mean it? Certainly. Certainly. All the evidence led me in one place I've been one time too many. Ralphie. When I told her, if you want your milk, then you go to the cow and you take your milk. <laughs> That's right. That's what I told her. Long time no see, Ralphie. Keeping out of trouble. Trouble? We'll try to tell you that I have any trouble. So why do I find this at the scene of a crime? That could be anyone's business card. It has your name and address on it. Can you see that I'm a good boy? That's what I try to be. I try to be a good boy. And all I want is just for it to be a little bit love, man. I just want a little love. Can't you see that, man? Now, Ralphie, be sensible oh, about this. Me. Dear Detective Maloney, sorry about what we did to you, but you ought to understand Poppy's sensitive side before you go around running your mouth off. I guess you should know where this all began. There used to be a third one of us, Lucille, Poppy's favorite. He gave her a diamond ring to prove his love for her, but then she left him, leaving his heart broken. While leaving, she dropped the ring. Selma and I found it later. We went to Poppy to tell him of Lucille's departure, but not of the ring that she had forgotten. When Lucille left, she became obsessed with diamonds and would do anything to have more. She is now known as the Queen of Diamonds. She's on 53rd Street, but don't even think that you can find her. She's untouchable. We wish you the best of luck, but beware. Lucille is used to getting what she wants, no matter the cost. Oh yes, another thing you should know. Lucille's actually... Aye! Poppy is on his way over. We must go. 
Sincerely, Rosa Iselma. I got it! Do you have it? Oh, uh, I, I didn't see it there. No time for talking. Do you have the diamond? Oh, here it is. Yeah. 